Hey boys and girls, get your passports ready. Today we are going to Italy. Italy. Miss Walsh just realized that we were on the wrong slide. I'm so sorry. Italy. So in Italy, they also celebrate Christmas. So I want you to be listening while I read to figure out what's the same in America that we celebrate, like in Italy, or what's different about how they celebrate Christmas in Italy. In Italy, people celebrate Christmas. So here's our map. This is about where we live. And we have to fly or we could take a boat all the way across the ocean to Italy. Christmas celebrations in Italy begin eight days before Christmas, known as no Novana. I think that's how we say that. So their celebrations start eight days before actual Christmas. During the Nova, Novana, children dress as shepherds and go house to house singing songs and poems. Sometimes they receive money. So that's something that's different. We don't necessarily, well, some people dress up at, as church as shepherds, um, but we don't really go house to house singing songs and doing poems, unless maybe we were um, doing Christmas carols. In Italy, people decorate trees and stream lights. But the most important decoration is the nativity scene. The nativity is a display of important Christmas figures. On Christmas Eve, they put a figure of baby Jesus in the manger. So some of our friends at home may have nativity scenes or you've seen nativity scenes. So this is something that's very important to the people in Italy. On Christmas Eve, most families go to midnight mass at church. So maybe some of our friends also go to church. I know Miss Wallace has been to a midnight mass before. After mass, families come home and celebrate with a special feast. Each person receives one small gift. So in the middle of the night, they come home and they have a big feast. Hmm, this is a hard word. Pan Pantanone is a traditional Italian dessert served on Christmas Eve. It is a sweet bread filled with raisins and dried fruit. I've never tried that before. I bet I would like it. It has raisins in it. Would you try that? 12 days after Christmas is called the Epiphany. This is the main day of gift giving. So they don't get uh, m many gifts. They get one small gift on Christmas Eve. But 12 days after Christmas, that's when they get gifts. In Italy, gifts are delivered on, it, on the Epiphany by an old witch on a broomstick called La Bafana. So this is who delivers their gifts. gifts. The legend of La Bafana says that she flies around looking for baby Jesus and leaves presents at every house in case he is there. Children hang stockings on their fireplace and La Bafana fills them with gifts if they've been good or coal if they've been bad. Have you ever gotten coal in your stocking before? Some families in America, they have um, a belief about coal as well, and they might get a, they might ha have Santa put coal in their stockings. I know when I was little, my sister got coal in her stocking one year. People around the world celebrate holidays in many different ways. Learning about the traditions of Christmas in Italy helps us to understand more about our world. The end. I really enjoyed going to Italy. I think it's interesting about La, La Bafana, a witch brings our gifts. All right, boys and girls, check out part two so we can do our around the world activity.